Oh. Confession time. I'm Anissa. I realized something while talking to you today. Perhaps there is a shortcut, if you will, to solving this matter. What do you mean? Something that should solve all, cons all my concerns at once, but it requires termination. I'm listening. Here we go, I think. But promise me you'll listen all the way through. Yes. I've discovered an even greater power than predicting people's fortunes. What I'm referring to is the power of our relationship. And if I may be honest, I've become quite enamored with you. That's why I want to be your your special partner from here on. Aww. Okay? That's cute. Her eyes look real beautiful there. And special partner, that's so cute. And I don't mean that in a workplace aspect either. Accept her love. Girlfriend number three. Let's be partners then. No contracts, no paperwork, just love. Yagami-san. You set my heart a flutter every time. Were you able to foresee this when you first met me? No. Not at all. I can only see the fate of other people, whereas my own remains a mystery. Ha. <laughs> I guess that spoiled all the fun, huh? <laughs> huh? What's this? I can see. You can see? Does that mean... Yes. I can see. The signs of calamity. So your powers have returned? Yes. And furthermore, yours has disappeared. What good timing, which means this really was a shortcut after all. What do you mean? Well, we're the ultimate pair. There's nothing for us to fear as long as we stay together. I truly believe that no calamity, no disaster, not even fate itself can break the power of our bonds. You know what? You're right. I feel like nothing can phase me now. I'm glad I could muster the courage to take this final step. Being close to your heart means everything to me. Amane-san. Yagami-san. Please dispense with that. With what? Amane is my last name. Got it. Then, let's be together. Tsumugi-san. Always. Yes, I'd like that. Takayuki-san. I wanted to apologize to you face to face. I'm sorry for what I did. Honestly, I don't even care anymore. Are you sure? Because I don't want our relationship to end this way. Then let me ask you something. Why would you betray my trust like that? I poured out my heart to you, gave you the one chance I've never given anyone else, and what did you do? Well, I... You played it off like it was one of your side, little side cases. I know, and I apologize. Stop apologizing, just tell me what you're really after. Okay. What I really want is you, Nanami. Huh? All I've ever wanted to do was get to know you better, to have a good time together and share some beautiful memories. That's the only reason I did such an idiotic thing. This isn't another trick you're playing on me, is it? Of course not. Please believe me when I say I'm telling the truth. How can I after all that's happened? I'm sorry. I need time to sort things out. Ooh. Yagami. If you walk away from me, I'm assuming this is the last time we'll see each other, right? Oh, so much pressure on the girl. Come on. Give her some time. Maybe it'll be the last time we see each other. I can't really say for sure. Then, what can I do to change your mind? How about letting go of me for starters? Just let me ask you one last thing. 
How do you really feel about me, Nanami? You said you weren't interested in romance, but we still managed to hit it off really smooth. It even got to the point where we went out drinking. No investigations, no pretenses, just the two of us having a good time. And it looked like you were happy whenever we were together. I know I felt that way about you. You really want to know how I feel? I feel like heading to the office. My job might break my spirit sometimes, but at least it doesn't break my heart. Oh, that line. I see, then I guess it's truly goodbye. Yeah, I guess it is. Oh, damn. That line. <sighs> Stabbed him in the soul. Yuko. Are you sure you're okay with this, Nanami? Letting it end on such a sour note? You keep stuffing your emotions away and burying yourself in work in an attempt to block out the rest of the world. Didn't you tell me you were going to make the next move when Yagami invited you out? Are you sure you don't need to tell him what you, f what you felt back then? You'll never change at this rate. I can see you becoming a bitter old lady dragging her past around wherever she goes. Is that really how you want to end up? Because good guys like Yagami won't, don't come around really often, you know? Fine. Yagami, there is one thing I need to communicate to you. What is it? Brace yourself. Oh! <laughs> Damn. What was that for? Oh, it is Yagami the confession. Do you have any idea why I'm so upset? I thought I could trust you, you know. I honestly thought you were going to be different from all the other guys out there. <sighs> I might be overreacting, but... <sighs> Can you even imagine? It's so wrong. Falling for someone who tricks you? That's messed up. That's why, if you're going to talk like you care about me, you need to act like you mean it. You can do that by... Being honest. No more lies or keeping secrets from me, okay? Oh, I really like that one. Alright, Yagami, I think I'm ready for that big talk now. I'm all ears, Sana. Okay. Deep breath, skill. Deep breaths. <laughs> oh, wow. They make it look really nice. <laughs> All HD and you know, shit. I've been meaning to tell you this for a little while, and I realized just how important you've been this whole time to me. We've been through so much. It feels like we've known each other for such a long time now. Yagimi-san, I am, um, well, I guess I just gotta say it. Are you ready? I love you. And the only thing I want is for us to be together. There. I said it. Whoa. <laughs> they made it look really nice. <laughs> Yagami-san. So, will you give me your answer? If you really think I'm good enough for you, then let's look forward to a bright future together. Huh? You really mean that? Of course, I've been waiting this for a long time too. Okay. Thank goodness. Don't go breaking my heart now. <laughs> I can hardly believe this is happening. It really is like a dream. I know I say this all the time, but it really is like we're living in a dream. It's no dream, I can assure you of that. Then show me. Oh, they're gonna kiss. Oh, she's only 19. 
Hey. Can I call you Takayuki-san from now on? Of course you can. Takayuki-san! It's gonna take some getting used to. But it'll come naturally as we spend more time together. Then I'll be looking forward to that. Takayuki-san. Still sounds really formal. So will I, Sana-chan. Guess I'll see you soon. But, I'm still super nervous, even more than I was at that interview. Don't worry, I'll wait as long as it takes. Ah, oh, come on, please don't let it be cringy. Well, here I go. I know this might seem sudden, but I still... I still gotta ask you anyway. From here on out, maybe you and I could see each other more? If that's okay. I really have been wanting to get to know you a little more. It's nice. <laughs> what I hoped for actually came true. And I feel like there's something else I need to tell you. Okay, so, the reason I'm applying, I mean, what am I trying to say? I realized, out of every single guy I know, you're the only one I think Whoa. I've ever been in love with. So, yeah. If you want me, then... I'm all yours. In love already? Damn, girl, you move fast. I'm sorry. Sorry for spraying this out on you. Out of nowhere. But I felt like I'd lose my chance if I didn't say something. And I just couldn't let that happen. <laughs> I'm just following your lead, you know? Stop overthinking and just go for it. Isn't that you take on things? Why me of all people, though? At some point, I realized I had feelings for you. But... Unlike me, you're a free spirit who lives by their own rules. And I really admire that about you. Thank you. I guess I need to give her an answer. Ah, oh, she's too young. But I'll accept her love, just for the sake of completing this. Then let's be together. Huh? You really mean it? Yeah, I feel the same about you. And I've been wanting to spend more time together, too. Get to know you deeper. <laughs> Nyagami-san. This isn't good. This is considerate cheating, right? Oh! <laughs> so he knows he's cheating. Wow. I got myself a dream job and a dreamy boyfriend. This is really happening. <laughs> Maybe this is all in my head and I'll wake up all of a sudden. If that's the case, then I don't want to wake up either. Nyagami-san. Nyagami-san. You make me so happy. I could cry. Then let's be happy together. I do have one request though. Huh? What is it? I want you to call me by my first name. Huh? You do? Why? You don't feel comfortable? No. It's not that. I mean, I guess I could try. Like -san. I guess it'll take some time getting used to. <laughs> right? Okay, so Yagami knows he's like four-timing. 